China has called on all parties to exercise maximum restraint, protect civilians and prevent a large-scale humanitarian crisis. Senior Chinese diplomat Yang Jiechi made a statement during a meeting with U.S. National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan in Rome, Italy. Yang called on the international community to jointly support the Russia-Ukraine peace talks and help de-escalate the situation. He said it's important to respond to the legitimate concerns of all parties. Yang Jiechi said China always stands for respecting the sovereignty and territorial integrity of all countries and abiding by the purposes and the principles of the UN Charter. He stressed that the Chinese side resolutely opposes any words and deeds that spread false information or distort and discredit China's position. The talks between senior Chinese and U.S. officials in Rome also covered bilateral ties and international and regional issues of common concern. Yang Jiechi stressed the importance of the implementation of the consensus between the two heads of state. He highlighted President Xi Jinping's three principles in developing bilateral relations, namely mutual respect, peaceful coexistence and win-win cooperation. Yang Jiechi also said the Taiwan question concerns China's sovereignty and territorial integrity. He reaffirmed that one China principle is the political foundation of China-U.S. relations. The White House said the talks between Yang and Jake Sullivan underscore the importance of maintaining open lines of bilateral communication. China has reiterated its support to all efforts that are conducive to the peaceful settlement of the Ukraine crisis. Chinese State Councillor and Foreign Minister Wang Yi made a statement during a phone conversation with Indonesian Foreign Minister Retno Masudi on regional cooperation in the Asia-Pacific. Wang Yi said China firmly supports ASEAN in playing a central role. Wang Yi said China welcomes countries outside the region to contribute to peace and stability in the region. He also said small and medium-sized countries should not be used as tools of big powers for confrontation. During his call with Spanish Foreign Minister Jose Manuel Abreis, Wang Yi said the Ukraine crisis is the result of the accumulation of security frictions in Europe over the years. He also expressed the hope that Europe and Russia will start dialogues and set up a balanced, effective and sustainable European security framework.